So FBG Butter, the guy that pretty much Lil J said off got off of the Italian beef and Pepsi for him to snitch, you know what I'm talking about? Pretty much he's going viral right now because FBG Butter did what the typical Chirac Savages was doing back in the day, you know what I'm talking about? It seems like a lot of them now, they calm down a little bit, you know what I'm talking about? You know, your Lil J's in jail, uh, run on number nine in jail. A lot of them in jail, a lot of them dead, you know what I'm talking about? There's only a few of them left. And FBG Butter just happens to be one of the ones that's left that's out and free. But what he did today, you know what I'm talking about, most definitely put his mother at risk of going back to the big house. And I'll get right into what he did right after the intro. Welcome back to Key Talk Media. This is your host, Key Talk. Check it out, man. All right. I'm going to get a shout out to Notification Game, Key Talk Game, for rocking with me every single video. If you listen to my voice right now, I'm going to hit the notification bell so you get a notification every single time I drop a video. Anyways, so FBG Butter pretty much was driving down a road with some other people in his car and he spotted an op. Now, back in the day, what the Shirek Savages did when they spot the op was either go interact with the op and by interact i mean put some knuckles to face some feet to face some elbows to face some wrists to face the head buzz to face everything but the ultimate thing they will put to face is a bullet now he spotted the op what do y'all think he did this is like after the whole Chirac era where everybody's either locked up dead jail or just doing something else right well uh, FBG Butter still got a little bit of that the savage shot rack inside of him. So he hopped outside the car, ran up to the op. You know, I can't put a video on, on uh, YouTube. Of course, you know, they will take it down black or whatever. But I will go follow me on my Instagram at Key Talk Media. Um, maybe I'll try to post a little bit over there. I probably have to bleep it out, though, because they'll even take it down now because they're getting strict with it. But anyways, he hopped out of the car immediately, walked up to the op and began fighting the op. Now, this could have went wrong a whole lot of different ways. The camera did go off, so you couldn't see like what happened at the ending. But it could have went wrong. You know what I'm talking about? He could have, old dude could have pulled out a gun and shot. It's Chirac. What? I mean, everybody's got a gun in Chirac. I mean, and Chirac is kind the standard right when you turn five years old they give you a gun they give you some bullets and they say listen you may need this to protect yourself because it's just that bad inside of Chirac anyways he didn't end up getting shot he didn't end up getting shot or killed nothing like that he actually put the paws on the guy and then of course like I said the video went off so you can't really see what happened at the ending but it, from what you can see it don't look like buddy got trusted already the guy kind of was like backing away uh but he did get some paws put on him anyways so how do y'all feel about this bro should y'all I think he should probably for one just leave Chirac I mean we know what the what happens to most of the artists in Chirac you're gonna die go to jail and I'm pretty sure Buddy's probably still on some type of like parole or probation or some um and like I said this is something that was recorded by his own partner so obviously he's not caring about that at all but let me know some how do y'all feel about this coming down below let me know what you think about this entire deal I'm out